In October 2023, we're told former Lake Travis High School football player Carter Manon told his teammates he had a severe peanut allergy that could result in his death. The district confirms in the days that followed, peanuts were thrown in his locker, on his uniform, and even directly at Manon. His mother, Shauna, spoke to us about the incident in February. Whenever he went to go and grab his stuff for his game, the residue got on his arm. And so he developed hives on his arm. The lawsuit says Shauna raised concerns to the head football coach and assistant principal. It adds nothing was done despite a cited section of the Texas Education Code, which mandates school districts prohibit bullying and harassment. The lawsuit claims school officials are deliberately indifferent to the ongoing harassment and says they fail to intervene or provide accommodations as required by its own policies and state law, despite the injury to Carter. Documents allege one of the teammates identified as student G boasted about about what he referred to as his attempted murder and being a killer on and off the field. At the end of October, a peanut butter granola bar was allegedly placed in Carter's bag, but still nothing was done. In the beginning, when we spoke with um, the coaches, you know, that was one of the, my concerns was we have to make sure that there is adequate discipline here and that there is no retaliation. Carter transferred to a different district in March of this year, around the same time the family received the findings of a school investigation, which concluded bullying, as defined by law and LTISD policy, has not occurred. Like Travis ISD responded to the lawsuit, saying in part, we disagree with the allegations contained in the lawsuit, and we look forward to responding through the appropriate legal channels. The safety of our students and staff is our highest priority. But the lawsuit says the report overlooked crucial details, including reported incidents of cyberbullying. We found some of the online posts referenced in the lawsuit, such as one tagged at the GIF peanut butter plant with a caption with an expletive followed by y'all thought y'all could stop us. And a comment where one user says it's insane that you guys are continuously joking about attempted murder, to which the account replies, please shut the up. The federal lawsuit accuses Lake Travis ISD of violating the Americans with Disabilities Act, a section of the Rehabilitation Act, and the students' constitutional rights. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.